with the faceless from the Haven. Even if we don't play the mission. I just realized that, like, I slept for eight hours last night. I don't have anything super heavy that I have to have done by tomorrow. I was, like, wondering if I could keep streaming late because I'm enjoying this campaign right now. And I think I actually can. We'll see how I feel in another hour and a half. Rendezvous. Why does it take seven turns? That just seems like a very bizarre amount of time for it to take for this evac to arrive. One. Two. I should be overwatching. Just in case. Three. I'm not going to use plasma grenades from the mutant autopsy. What else does it do? Four. Gets me advanced grenades. Five. I don't think I'm going to build like incendiary bombs for my grenadiers. Smoke bombs. Okay. Actually, that could be good. We'll see about it. Yeah, I'll do it. I'll do the mutant autopsy. This is Firebrand. It's time to go. I'm gone. I will do this for you. Better ablative, really? No, it gives me ablative with armor. Isn't it two hit points and armor? I don't think that's better than three hit points. All the enemies just have Shredder. The Mr. Fraser! Thanks for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Wait, it would... It would still be better, wouldn't it? Hmm. You may be onto something there. You may be onto something there. No, it's a vest. It's a tactical vest. Yeah, that's not better than the nanoscale plate. Nanoscale plate has minus 25 crit. That's way more important than one armor in this iteration of the game, I think. Hey, yeah, Carlos Donger. I'm glad to hear it. Uh, we just lost two rebels in this haven, so it was actually completely full of faceless. But now they're gone. Life continues. Four days in the shadow chamber. I will change to muton autopsy. I've been convinced. I've been convinced. I'm not sure that I will ever actually do anything with that, but the data pad didn't seem necessary. I'm not going to, like, be doing difficult missions to hunt for. It's ducky. I'm not going to be doing difficult missions to hunt for more late game corpses or anything in this campaign. It looks like I got two Andromedon Rex somehow, so I get one tier three holo targeter, which is awesome. But in general... In general, I'm not planning to have a huge stockpile of Mutant Elite corpses or something like that. Okay, this is still guarded, so it's going to be nine enemies against six ridiculous XCOM soldiers. I like our odds. I like our odds. Mutant Elite gives 